aggressive going to the rim, offensive board, attacking the glass. So I thought Amari was uh, really playing at a pretty high level. Any idea how Jacob or Loon are doing in terms of any progress either one of those guys? Uh, they're, they're both doing better. Uh, neither one will play uh, tomorrow. Uh, I think Jacob's, from what I heard yesterday, talking with him directly and with our training staff, still at least a couple of weeks uh, away. Uh, Loon is, is doing better. He's uh, working out every day. He's getting some good work in. So, uh, We'll just kind of see see how that goes. But uh, Smilagic and Spellman. Uh, Spellman uh, did not practice today, so he's out for, for tomorrow. Uh, Smilagic uh, told me he dunked today, uh, which is a good sign. So he was excited about that. So his his ankle is improving. That's really what you want, especially as a young dude, uh, just to see your progress and to have somebody show you your progress each game and shoot, he, even each practice, like they're, they're, they're on it like that. So um, that comfortability is, is key for, for, especially for us young guys, it's like having somebody that's you know, constantly telling you uh, what you can get better at and what you do well at it. Um, how to get your game to this level. And, I mean, it, it, it helps just by having, like you said, there's a different array of ages of guys. So like, you know, the language is different between some guys. So some guys have to talk. It's just, a, it's a lot to, um, you know, deal with. But as a, as a young core, um, everybody's receptive to it, so it's good. You know, boxes and elbows, uh, fill, the, fill the gaps, like when you guys are driving. Coach, the last five yeah. years. How is he sort of dealing with this? Yeah, um, you know, for me personally, I've I, I haven't been you know in a situation like this since my rookie year in Minnesota. Um, you know, as far as the games, but um, I was excited to come here to see you know his coaching abilities, you know his, his capability as a coach. I've heard a lot of great things about him, but to really be on the court with him um, and work with him every single day, you know, I think he does a great job of handling wins and losses. You know, um, and really teaching you know that's that's what it's about you know it's a long season um, we say that all the time but I think the way that he is able to you know kind of execute his job and kind of keep everybody on an even mindset you know um, and, and, and sometimes he comes in it's not even about basketball we talk about current events he talks about life things and that keeps everybody wanting to play harder for him and wanting to really um, go hard and succeed